Well, I'm here with Adam White from Intelligent Membranes. Uh, we're, we're here at the uh, FierceCon. So for people that haven't um, come across this, but I mean, it, it seems like it's emerging uh, as, a, as a product category. Um, and it, it's a little bit self-explanatory, um, but just tell us exactly what the product is. What does it do? Well, if you can think of your traditional paper membranes, maybe like a Tyvek on the exterior of mm -hmm. your building, we have the liquid version of that. Yeah. So where you have your tapes, we have a brush version with fibres in, where you paint over all the joints, yeah. and then we come in and we spray all of the products, all of the OSB, all of the building. It's bright, purple, <laughs> yeah. airtight, yeah. and it's a vapour control as well. Right. And we do different versions. So we have internal, external, vapour open, vapour closed. Right. I imagine a lot of people have questions about uh, consistency because when you have a membrane off a roll, it's you know it's all consistent and you know what you're getting. Yep. There must be some variation in um, the thickness as to the, small, the permeability. Only very small amount. So with a wet gauge thickness, these guys doing the install, it's just like when you're painting your house, emulsion right. paint. These guys can get it quite accurate with the sprayer and then do the checking as they're going along. Right. So you mentioned uh, application. If someone's specifying this, are they, is it something they're going to be doing themselves or do you get a, a specialist applicator? It can be both. So we have approved installers throughout mm -hmm. the world, but then we also do free training. We do free webinars, show the people how to install it, how to check it. Right. So we get a lot of home builders buying it as well and they just go on YouTube, check out our videos yep. and do it themselves because you don't need a spray. You can, you can roll apply this product as well. Right. Any problems with... Um, Approvals, uh, appraisals, accreditations, you know, those sorts of things. If, if people need like a, a weather tightness barrier that has to perform to a certain oh, standard. So, so all of our stuff is ASTM tested, um, EN tested. We're going through ICC currently and the right. CMCC. Um, throughout the world, we've got different um, criteria matches yeah. for all that country. So yeah. like the UK, we have the BBA. And then in Australia, we have something different. Yeah. So every yeah. country I go to, we, we start the process. Again. Yeah, which must be a bit painful. But <laughs> it is, but we've already got the testing, so it's just them right. checking. It's more of a checking process to say, right. yeah, we're happy with that. Yeah. So you've got weather tightness, mm -hmm. and you've also got air tightness and yeah. vapour control. Are they... Com Completely different products? Completely different products. So one's vapour open, which will let the building breathe more. Yeah. And then one's more vapour closed to stop the moisture going through. Right. But we are an intelligent membrane. So if we get above 80% humidity, our products will open up and let the building breathe a bit more like it should do. Right. So that's how we're on a lot of retrofit projects, heritage uh, projects. So we won't just lock in all the moisture. Yep. We'll control it, and if it, it's like a bouncer on your, your wall. Yeah. We, we just say who comes Boy. in the club. Boy. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> yeah. Who, who can come in, who can come out, yeah. and that's what you we are. Shady. We do the checks. Um, and you, retrofit, I mean, it must be a, um, such a uh, great solution because that is so hard to do yeah, times there's, on the inside, retro, there's, so you know, many, there's so many junctions, there's so yeah. many bits, but when you can just grab a paintbrush and just go over the whole lot, and you've checked up and over all the joints and it, joists yeah, and everything. Spray away, spray yeah. away. I, I've also seen some liquid membranes work in conjunction with uh, more traditional membranes. Uh, can your products work if, if somebody just wanted to spray a junction but then use a um, a material, can you, can you join yeah, it so in that Yeah, so a lot of our competitors we work with, so Sega Membranes, their yeah. products will work for our products. Right, um, yeah. so you might do the tricky bits with, yeah. with purple. <laughs> yeah, and if, if they need to tape to our products, we can, we right. can work with that as well. Yeah. well. I think we've got a demo on the, on the front here. Right, yeah, cool. Um, and great that you mentioned Australia, uh, and even in places like America, a huge variety of different climate zones. Mm -hmm. So the fact that it's an intelligent membrane, does that account for all those, the seasonality differences? Yeah, with so we, we, can, we can move the membranes the way we want them to. So if we need it to be more vapour closed on the outside, we can then put our internal on the external. Right. Although we do call it internal, it can go either way. Yeah. So we just need to judge it to that climate zone. Yeah, um, yeah. Get the whoopee calculations and just see what's the best Great. scenario. Awesome. Um, so you've had, have you had some success with some passive house projects? 
Um, yes, we have some successes, and in the UK, we actually built um, a passive house bar, um, and we got an air test of zero point zero seven on it. Wow! So when That's we get cool. our um, license, we'll be there in the Guinness Book of Records for the world's most airtight pub in the world. That so, seems very appropriate. That's a good accolade <laughs> to have, I think. Yeah, absolutely. And uh, you're one of the, I don't know what you call it, founding suppliers, vendors on Source 2050? Well, I've got a hat to be. After spending the last three years on the Passive House Accelerator, following the story of Michael yeah. and the team, and then as soon as I found out Source 2050 was going to be born, I thought, what a great opportunity to uh, get into the specification of projects and yeah. just be with everyone, really. Yeah, awesome. Um, well... Obviously, that's a great place to be found and for people to find out more information. You've got your own website people can find you as well? Yep, www.intelligentmembranes.co.uk. Right, and so .co.uk at the moment? You're gonna, um, you're gonna... Well, we have a .com as well. Yeah. Right, okay, awesome. So... Hey, well, thank you. Uh, thanks for being here, um, no but also thanks for your uh, support of uh, Passive House Accelerator. It's much appreciated. And uh, all the best. You know, I think it's really exciting. Um, a whole category, um, but uh, you know, exciting to hear your story as well. So, well done. We'll catch you next year with hopefully a bigger stand as well. Absolutely. All okay. right. Cheers, Thank Ed. you.